Hey, what is up, boys? Welcome back. Um, hope you guys liked the last video. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed filming it, uh, fishing, and all that. Editing. Love to get back in the groove of that whole thing. You guys already heard my spiel about the break. Kind of sucked, but I'm back. And, um, yeah. It's fun to go fish with Lucas. Always fun to catch fish. But, yeah. So, I know I told you guys about a uh, little Christmas trip I was going up to Minnesota for. That got postponed because we're currently in a blizzard and it's nuts outside. It's god awful. So we aren't able to go up to Minnesota. Bummer, but that's getting pushed back to New Year's New Year's Eve and New Year's Day that whole that weekend. So but yeah, but I still have plans to go fish the day after Christmas, I believe. And Lucas and I are gonna hit this big old little secret bass pond that we found or that he knew of that we went to last year and hold some mondos crazy absolutely crazy pond um big bluegill big panfish in there i was crystal clear when we went so um i don't know if lucas is gonna bring his under uh, underwater camera but maybe maybe i can um get some footage off of that um but it's gonna be a good time i'm excited uh, hopefully to get some bass off of that pond because I, like I said, I caught my first bass last last video and it was smaller than some creek chub that I caught in the creeks. So I hope I can get on some slabs out there. I'd love that. Um, they're always a fun fight, especially on you know small rod. Can't beat it. Um, one of the perks of ice fishing is sometimes the fish is bigger than your rod, so we love that. But yeah, that's it. I'm gonna I'm gonna shut up now. <laughs> I'll see you guys when I get to the pond. All right, so we are at the pond. We got Lucas and Matt set up. We're gonna set along tip ups along the along the middle of the pond here and then the other holes obviously jig through them so we got big old bass and bluegill i think that's it hopefully we can get in some big bass i really really want a big bass through the ice he said that little bass does not count so yeah we already have some marks in the mark them i'll see you guys in a gopro so we are set up holes drilled ice is talking if you guys never hear from me again i am in the middle of northwest iowa random pond will we ever be found probably not am i okay with that probably not so we are dropping in i don't even know how far down i am may or may not have forgot my vex and by may or may not have forgotten my vex i completely forgot my vex yeah so we little set up got this whole for jigging right here i have my tip up line over there lucas jigging over there and his tip up and then holmstrom right here and his tip up so we're using all our lines oh there we go i'm on Got one? yep oh nicer bluegill all right oh yeah nice size bluegie i haven't been fishing more than Two minutes, already got into one. Hell yes. I guess I wasn't, oh, another, let's go. That's a nicer one. Oh, take that back. Take that back, tiny. Oh, I'm always on a school of them, I think. So, two bluegill, one bass, in under five minutes. It's a good day. And I forgot my Vex, so we're fishing blind. Get on the bass instead of the bluegill. But right now, we've only been fishing for a lot. Oh! Double up with Holmstrom. Let's go, baby! Oh, that's a nice bluegie. Alrighty. <laughs> PB! Yeah. Oh, let's go, oh baby! Bass. That's a big. Oh! I got a bass also. <laughs> Let's go. Bass there. Better than the last one I caught. Let's go. Some great collars on that thing. Look at that. Yeah, I know. They're really vibrant. 
you know, that, that hit hard. I'm like, it's either it's a bass or a big old bluegill. Good bass. Still not quite the size that we want, though. We want some Mondos. It's good that we're catching bass, though. We have been fishing for about an hour. <laughs> Absolutely just been hammering the bluegill. Got into about three three small bass apiece. But there are big bass in here, so hopefully we can hammer into those. Oh, buddy. Buddy Holmes from over here has been just hammering away uh, at the... for the past 15 minutes <laughs> let's see that we are on top of a pretty solid school we're on top of a pretty solid school but yeah uh no big bass yet i am currently just rolling the dice letting my rod dead stick right there yeah no flags have gone up yet so maybe maybe you can get into a big bass hopefully oh home swim is on one that way bud all right home. let's see it Let's go. There we go. First, like, right. good sized bass. Look at that boy. There you, go. there you go. Now you can work on him. That's a lot of you. Now he's it's not us anymore. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. All right, lift it up. There we go. Let's go. Yes, sir. Here you go. Back to the wild you go. Oh. Home strong. Can you even get my minnow? How, how does it feel to catch a, a good fish, a real fish? A real fish? I mean, I've been catching some decent fish today, but you know, I knew it was going to happen to me at some point. <laughs> it, it was just destined. <laughs> so Holmstrom got his first, or got the first kind of real bass. There is some shrubs and trees sticking up over here. I really want to try and drill a hole about like right in this vicinity. And see if I can pull one just sitting by the trees or anything so yeah let's see if we can do that so the boys and I are checking up our tip-ups don't think we got anything on have yet to have a tip-up go up all day checking on the well-beings of our minnows munching on some mechanics See how she's doing. Uh oh. Down there Nothing. My little buddy's dead. Not one bite. So, yeah. <laughs> Bummer. Alright. So I'm at that other hole. So I'm just drilled. Marking about 10 foot. So about the same as everything else here. Oh, that's Mark. There we go. Oh, that's a... Smaller bass. All right. Smaller bass. About the same size that I've been catching all day for the bass. A lot of marks. Oh, God, look at that. Yeah, no, holy shit. Holy. Gotta get off the tender. <laughs> Do it. There we go. That's a smaller bluegill. Tangled up in the juicy. Let's see if I have any marks on here. I doubt it. All right. I finally have been hammering back onto the fish, taking a break. The old, the old paws are frozen. So we'll check up on the boys. How has your day been going? It's been slower than the one bass. Yes. Lots of danks. What, what, have you been doing anything like special or like what's the deal? Oh, yeah. I always use this for bass. A lot of rattle to that. If you can hear it, I don't know. Yeah. I usually put waxies on there and hope for the best. So Lucas caught himself a nice little like half pound or maybe a little bit over that. But right now through the ice that is that is a little bit nicer than the little dinks that we've been catching. 
but we have yet to get on any of the monsters that we know is out here so maybe we will get on one of those and Matthew Holmstrom right here has been having a day Sure 41, like what, 41? 41 is now. 41 fish. On top of the 41 fish, he has our big bass today. And at 50 fish, he said it, at 50 fish, he's biting a, uh, a fish's head off. So, I hope you like the taste of sushi. Holmes, bro. That's what I'm doing right now. <laughs> <laughs> happy with 40. 41? Nine more. I hope you catch nine bass. I really do. Switch to bass fishing. I don't care. Catch fish. One eternity later. Hooked in two. Some. Some was biting me. Took my waxy. Assume it's a bl ambitious bluegill. Or something like that. Good God, hit it again. I felt that one just rip out of its mouth. Oh, baby. Nope. Ambitious, ambitious, ambitious bluegie. All right, this little bluegie. Finally, we are back on the board. That was a while. That was a while that have you gotten a fish? I really thought that that one was gonna be my big bass for today. I am back into bluegill. I might just turn this into a bluegill video. <laughs> well, honestly, what have you been catching? We caught one bass. Well, like one- One sizable, bass. yeah. Like two decent bass. We need a pike outdoor fund. <laughs> pike needs to buy a uh, pan optics. Live scope. I had to work for that, man. <laughs> How long has it been since you've... <laughs> it's been like an hour. <laughs> it's been a while since we got a... I've been trying strictly for bass, though. He's got a little fella here. He's yeah, hanging yeah. out with a bunch of bluegill. I think okay. all the little ones are. I'll put yeah. you back. See it? Oh, wow, oh. that was <laughs> graceful. Out of the way, look at this. <laughs> you guys remember about... I don't know. A while ago. Oh, Holmstrom and I over here were talking about he gets the 50 fish, he'll bite a head off a fish. Well, let's not bite a head off a fish. We don't, we don't want to do that. So, 48! That is 48! So now he has to lick a fish. A I do agree on that. I will not eat a fucking... I will not bite a head off a fish. <laughs> okay, I, 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 I think that's fair. That is more than That fair. is way more than fair. I'm not you don't have to bite a fish's head off. Else, what? I think there's a situation where you'd bite a fish's head off. I do it at 50. If I had 50 fish, I, I would... Better get fishing. I have like maybe 30 fish. But yes, we're at 48. 50, he is licking. He's licking a fish. We gotta do something to keep this interesting. We are just been sitting for a few hours, maybe catching a fish here and there. Progressively getting right, colder. Right here, right? Let's see it. <laughs> well, you hit 49. Right here. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Oh, 49. Let's go. Oh, wrapped around. Wrapped around the deuce. Land it. <laughs> Let's go. All right, one more. You might as well stay on because it won't take long. It didn't even take my worm, so. Oh, he's getting. Call we're, shot. We're, we're calling we're them. We're still marked. There's a we're whole them. Look at my vex. Now mark them, mark them. <laughs> oh, got one. Forty. That's fifty. All right. Come on, buddy. You're, right. the, you're the lucky one. So we are at fifty. Let's see it. I'll, give, I'll even give her a kiss too. All right. Ooh. Oh! Oh! oh. That it didn't taste like anything. Oh! It just came out of the water. I don't Ooh. think there's enough time for it to <laughs> to taste. Here we like. go, big fifty fish man. We'll have a nice little chat. Well, you need some Mike and Ikes. All right. So, buddy, home from caught. 
Oh, 50, yeah, fifty fish on the dock. Fifty one right now. Yeah, fifty one. Lucas, somewhere around there. I am around. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> All right, <coughs> we are back. Lucas is around that 30, 40 ish mark. I'm around the same place where Lucas is. He might have a few more than me. Um, I think I'm gonna call it. This is how we're gonna end the video. Nice laid down on the ice, eating some Mike and Ikes. Um, it wasn't as successful with the big bass as we thought it was going to be, but that's just how fishing is. Got some good bluegill, a lot of bluegill. Um, ooh, some sizable bluegill. So yeah, um, we're going to end the day off here. Sun is setting. I will see you when I get home. What is up boys? I am back. Um, just got done finishing that video and I mean I might not have caught that big old bass that's in there that we know that's in there or any of the big bass in general but uh, I know it was important. I got to hang out with the boys, got some good fishing so I mean to me that's a win. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching that video. Um, I know the boys and I had a great time on ice, just goofing around, catching catching bluegills. But yeah, fishing is not always about catching that PB or that big monster. Sometimes it's about catching a hundred of those dinks and uh, tiny bass and just hanging out with the boys. So yes, I'll see you guys next week.